The Internal Arts Academy is the online aspect of the Lotus Negong School. Um, it's basically a platform that we've been developing uh, for the last year, really. Uh, it started as an idea, and then it's just kind of grown out of there, as these things do. So originally, the idea was to provide uh, ongoing online visual support uh, to the students who train with us in Lotus Negong. Um, and then gradually, the, the idea kind of snowballed out of control. And now we have this platform, the Internal Arts Academy, that we're ready to present very soon to the world. So basically what happens is people subscribe uh, to the site and then they get access to an ongoing uh, structured training in Negong. So every single week, um, an essentially instructional video opens up with supporting material um, that will lead people step by step into authentic internal training, really. Um, internal training according to what I've been studying for, you know, almost all of my life across Asia and the, and the West. One of the things I've been asked for over and over again by people around the world contacting us on social media was, can you help, you know, can you provide any guidance uh, on the, the correct stages, the correct sequence of training? Because it's just like anything, you know, it's not just learning the tools, it's learning the order to work through the tools in. What are the stages? What is the correct timing for each of these processes? So this is what we've tried to present in the ongoing weekly classes. This was the first idea anyway, was to provide this weekly ongoing program, but as with everything that involves Lotus De Gong or me, it tends to get overexcited and then explode, and now we have all sorts of things involved in the program as well. So as well as the ongoing weekly classes, that is the main part of the program, or was supposed to be, we also now have the library as well. So the library um, originally started as a place where we would put up my lectures from the courses I deliver around the world, because when I teach seminars on Ne Gong or Tai Chi, um, I tend to give one or two hour talks on most of the days, actually. Normally, so students can rest their legs a little bit and listen to some theory. Um, but gradually, the, that sort of library of theory has expanded out. So now what's going to happen is every course that I teach, the theoretical, theoretical lectures will be put up uh, in the library. So gradually, over the years, it'll grow and grow and grow until people can go back and see theoretical lectures from years back on all sorts of subjects, ranging from internal alchemy and meditation through to health, Chinese medicine and martial arts, you know, I mean, the internal arts are a big subject and I like to cover them as much as I can within these courses. So these will be here, sort of saved for prosperity. On top of that, we also have um, a few structured courses people can follow. So our previous programs on foundations of Qigong and Dragon Dao Yins um, and so on are, are also on there, as well as a complete course in um, Heavenly Streams practice, a form of Qigong that enables you to understand and experience uh, the channel system of the body. Um, there's also a very detailed program, I think it's about 12 hours or something, on Qigong deviation sickness, so errors that can arise in internal training, anything from Qigong through to Kundalini or meditation can bring problems. Um, you know, nothing in life is guaranteed to be, guaranteed to be 100% safe, so what we have is uh, 12 hours of instruction on, on the inner workings of Qigong, Kundalini and and so on and so on. How do these things work? How, does, how do problems arise? And, and how can they be treated from a Chinese medical perspective? Um, so these are kind of examples of the programs that sit within the library that are available right from the beginning. I think the library amounts to about 70 hours footage already or something. And we're constantly adding to it as well. There's external martial arts training on there and future programs in feng shui and medicine and all sorts coming up. You know, it's going to be a big thing. You know, this is a big deal. As I said, with anything I get involved in, I tend to get carried away, and I'm more than happy to just uh, keep uploading footage from all the different uh, places I teach and things like this. Um, we also have plans for the future as well as the library and as well as the weekly program. I mean, eventually what will happen is all of the subjects uh, that are taught within Lotus and Gong will have online support. Um, so a bit further down the line, probably a couple of months from now, I think is a projected plan, we'll also have um, a Taiji program. Taiji Chuan, so just like the Negong program, ongoing weekly classes um, in the Yang style of Tai Chi. Um, and we also have a Bagua Jiang program coming after the summer as well. Um, and then further again down the line, Chinese medicine will also be included. And that will support the uh, material taught within the Chinese medicine college um, that I'm a part of. So gradually what will happen is when people sign up and join the Internal Arts Academy, what happens is they'll have access to all of these different aspects of the Internal Arts. And of course, People can study one aspect of it or several branches, whatever they wish. The material on there will support um, what is taught by myself and the other Lotus Negong uh, teachers on courses that we run around the world. The idea is that we slowly build up a community of people that have access to this material and, you know, 
I'm sure through online support, Facebook groups and whatever, we can um, you know, have ongoing discussions and Q&A sessions and uh, things like this. And, and gradually the idea is to try to uh, spread traditional and, uh, well, definitely traditional, you know, maybe not, not modernize too much, you know, maybe sometimes we use modern language, but still the, the training must follow the traditional route uh, through the Taoist arts. Uh, so gradually we will keep expanding and uh, keep growing this program until the internal arts community destroys the internet or something. I don't know. We'll see what happens. So uh, I hope you enjoy it and uh, I look forward to seeing some of you there.